Elizabeth, did you enjoy playing Shakespeare? Well, I was absolutely terrified in the beginning. First of all, I'm, uh, my accent is essentially American, even though I'm British. And I've never done Shakespeare before. And the whole idea of acting was all the marvelous Shakespearean actors, all the great character players, including my husband, who's a marvelous character actor. I certainly am. <laughs> I was really terrified, and I was so scared that the first day of shooting, at my own request, and everybody agreed, but they were terribly sweet about it. I could see the expressions on their faces. I mean, it just wouldn't do, because I was paralyzed. I couldn't get a word out. But nobody else thought that, I may say. The other actors, the brilliant actors like Michael Horton and uh, Cyril Cusack and Victor Spinetti and so on, thought that Elizabeth was perfectly all right the first day, but she insisted on reshooting it anyway. In order to show you that we're not averse to first nights, and particularly the first night of The Taming of the Shrew, which is very near to us because it happens to be our first production, and we'd like to show you some scenes where we, I hope, show some sort of nervous excitement about attending the Royal Film Performance in London. This is Leicester Square in London. The setting for the most spectacular entertainment event of the year, the world premiere of Elizabeth Taylor and Richard Burton's new motion picture, The Taming of the Shrew. The arrival of the Burtons has a special excitement all its own. Crowds have waited for hours in the rain for this moment. The screen's most celebrated acting couple join the great and the famous who have come from three continents for the widely heralded opening. A brilliant core of international stars converges on the Odeon. Among them are Gina Lola Brigida and Christopher Plummer and Bernalisi. The premiere of the Burton Zeffirelli production is a royal film performance. This is Britain's most important annual screen event. Princess Margaret is the royal patron. Before the performance begins, a galaxy of film notables will be presented to Her Highness. Mia Farrow. Lawrence Harvey and Tom Courtney acknowledge a royal greeting by the princess. Franco Zeffirelli directed The Taming of the Shrew. Richard McWhorter was executive producer. Sir Michael Redgrave is presented. The climax of the pre-premiere ceremonies is the presentation of Elizabeth Taylor and Richard Burton to Princess Margaret. Cameras of the international press record the meeting. It all adds up to a truly royal send-off for the screen's reigning king and queen and their latest motion picture, The Taming of the Shrew.